Hello, it's great to be with you again today. Pastor John here. Did you ever just stop and think about how many times in a day things just happen? I mean, we, we have calendars that we write stuff on. And if you're if you're as like mine, it's just about full all the time. But we um, you didn't plan it. Things just pop up into your schedule. And we have to try to find ways to fill the fill those gaps or fill it to put them in those gaps. The phone rings. The boss asks you to do something extra. Someone you love has an emergency. And on and on and on you could go. It's all part of the day. And as the day unfolds, a lot of those unexpected things that happen, we handle with no problem. We just put them in a spot and do them. But sometimes, what if, what if you need that extra help? What if you need someone else to get involved, say, like Jesus? When, you're, when you give your heart to Christ, a benefit, if you will, is that you get an open line, a helpline to the Savior. In, first, in John chapter 9, verse 31, we read, And we know that God heareth not sinners, but if any man be a worshiper of God, him he heareth. Let's think about that saying here real quick. One is, number one is, God, it says, God heareth not sinners. Now that's twofold. One fold is, he doesn't hear a word a person prays until they're saved. We need to make sure that we have Jesus in our heart. It's the person praying in a foxhole when bullets are flying over his head. But he's not saved. He's like praying to a wall. Secondly, the second part of that is, is once we are saved, we need to make sure that we have sin confessed, as, as any open sin confessed that we know of. So you need, so, so that whenever you need to pray, you don't need to, one of those pop-up things come along, you know, you don't need to say, oh, wait a minute, I got some praying to do to get some things straightened out. Or you just not might you just may not have that time to say, wait a minute. Someone needs you at two o'clock in the morning. They don't necessarily want to wait till three o'clock in the morning until you get yourself straightened out. We've got that open helpline. Christ wants to hear us. Christ wants to help us. And the fact is, if I keep my part of the deal, Christ for sure will keep his part of the deal. So every day, all day, let's give a shout out to God and think, think about what a God we have. Take him, face the day, and with, and with all its pop-ups, and we'll come out winners. Now until we're together again, you make it a great day and may God bless.